Welcome back to the show, JD Aliens. It's time to get down once again. But first, I gotta address the new guy girl who just showed up, so veterans hang out there for a second. Look, if you came to watch a guy unbox some products, get his jam on, and most likely embarrass himself on the internet, uh, yeah, you're in the right spot. If you came here for a whole bunch of texts and mumbo jumbo that nobody understands or sometimes doesn't even care about, yeah, you came to the wrong spot. So go ahead and tuck your chair in and go ahead and walk out. Don't worry about it, man. Nobody's going to judge you and you're welcome back anytime you please. So let's get on with the show, man. Let's do it. So today we're going to be checking out the EI's ARC Active Doors Canceling Headphones. You know what, man, EOS, I, I hope I'm pronouncing it right. EOS is known for style. I've checked out uh, probably two of their uh, true wireless earbuds at this point and the styling, the attention to detail that goes into their styling is pretty much second to none, man. They are truly some of the most beautifully designed products I've had come across this desk. But we're talking about the ARC today. You know what, I don't get it in specs, but I gotta read what's on the box, man. Get in here so you can see it with me. Hold on, man, get in there, there you go. Bluetooth. 5.0 24 hours worth of play time and you got some uh, supported audio stuff there which is aptx aptx ll sbc and aac for all you spec junkies out there oh kill me with this mess anyways man what else is on this box let's see active noise canceling dual microphone cbc technology for all y'all who don't know what that is that is phone call active noise canceling so it's some it's like a pair of mics or a, an array of mics that cancel out background noise as you're talking on the phone so we're definitely going to have to uh, check out the call quality on these things oh wow you got some 40 millimeter uh custom made speakers and yeah they're lightweight because this box really ain't that heavy but let's go ahead and get into it man oh yeah mm, i smell it already you smell that man Oh yeah, you know what that smell is, man. <laughs> new stuff. Hashtag new stuff in the comment section, please. Okay, this is actually a pretty nice 3.5 to 3.5 millimeter cable. It's got some nice uh, connecting ends right there. And then you get your USB-C to USB-A charging cable right there. And now we get to the star of the show. Look at him, man. Just look at him. That's kind of sexy. You got your... EOS right there. Can you see that right there? Highly reflective stuff, but hopefully you can still see it. There's your headband right there, your all metal headband. And then there's your EOS logo on the side right there. And then you've got those ear cups. They don't swivel or fold, but they do have some play in them. So you can actually uh, kind of adjust them to your ears. Now, if you look at this right here on the top, that is where you get your comfort from. Cause it's not just, you know, like they're gonna put your head up to a steel band. You do have some cushion right here and it is super soft. Same material and same plushness as the ear cups right here. You see this nice wide opening for the ears to uh, just kind of flop in. They're not very deep ear cups, so we'll have to see you know, how good they are on base, but that really does place the drivers right next to your ear hole. So they should be a pretty good sounding set of headphones. If you get right here, you'll see that there's a uh, multifunction button with, what is that on there? I can't read it. Ah, it's a Bluetooth symbol. So you got a Bluetooth symbol right there, but that's a multifunction button for play and pause and stuff like that. Then you got an up and down where basically a plus and minus for your tracks and volume. And then you have right here an ANC switch. So this switch right here can actually be turned on as the headphones are off. Uh, that way you can listen to silence with no music playing. I know that's kind of a pun, but it it, it is what it is. Okay, so sometimes people just want to turn on the ANC without playing music or even turning the, uh, the headphones on. But beware that if you actually leave that on, it will drain your battery over time. So make sure you just make sure to turn that off every time you're done with your headphones. Now, as far as weight, these things are ultra lightweight. They just kind of, all the weights right here in the ear cups. And I'm okay with that because that's what's going on your head or on your ears. So let's just try them out, see how they feel. Oh, okay. All right, so they do. Okay, so I got mixed feelings about the way they feel. As far as the weight and clamping force, everything is great. It's perfect, it's spot on. You could actually kind of forget they're on your head until you start paying attention to your ears because I have relatively small ears, but I can feel my ears pressing up against something. It's, it's the ear cup. Even though the ear cup is pretty soft, actually it's really soft, my ears are still kind of they're touching something, man. So it's not necessarily the best fit for me, 
But the swivel, the, the play they have in them, it does make them feel relatively comfortable on your head. It's just that I can feel my ears touching something on the top right here. Let me see if I can get an adjustment, get my ear in that cup. Okay, that is a little bit better, but you might have to play around with this. So if you've got, you know, highly sensitive ears when they touch headphone ear cups and stuff like that, try these out, man, and just kind of wiggle them around, get, get your ear in there and just see if they're going to work out for you. This is this is new for me right here, but they do expand. Let me show you where they expand. So you can expand them just a little bit. You see that wire in there? Dude, you are far, so far back. Get in there. There you go. All right. So you see that wire in there. See how it expands, but it will stretch to capacity. Now, this um, this band right here is not going to let it pull the wire out, but I would be you know, kind of cautious as you're pulling this thing down to adjust. Don't just yank it down, you know, slide it down because it does have some uh, resistance there. So just kind of slide it down. I don't think I need to move mine at all, to be honest with you, because I kind of have a small head. OK, now that I've got them adjusted on my head again, everything's feeling nice and comfortable. Let's test out that ANC real quick. So let me turn that switch on. All right, these. Oh, <laughs> OK, so these definitely take, mm, I don't know, about 50% out of the base of your surrounding sounds, okay? So when it comes to low engine roars uh, and stuff like that, you know, maybe some traffic, like the, the bassier tones in the traffic, it's definitely gonna take it out. I do feel a little bit of cabin pressure. Now, to those not uh, familiar with how ANC works, cabin pressure is the, the feeling that you get it's kind of like being on an airplane. You know, when you go up and your ears start popping, you feel that pressure on your ears. Uh, it's nowhere near as bad as being on an airplane, but you do feel a little bit of it because you it's just how active noise canceling works. It, it is what it is. But I can still hear the, uh, the the treble, okay? So when you hear things like horns, babies crying, you know, your, your girlfriend or your, your wife nagging you, you're still going to hear that pretty much loud and clear. It might be pushed back to the background a little bit in the distance, but you're still going to be able to hear it. Now, when it comes to low rumbles like thunder, um, you know, trucks and stuff like that, it's going to muffle that sound quite a bit. Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm getting from the ANC performance. So let me turn the ANC off and then I can answer some more questions. But I know most of y'all have one question. Oh, the new guy girl doesn't know what the question is. Come on, man. You know what you came here for. But do they jam though? Ooh, I got a new one for you. I like the way that sounds. I'm about to do it for you. Ooh, all right, man. Yep, they do jam. Yes, man, they do jam. But let me tell you about the details on how they jam. Now, the experience with the ANC on, or I'm sorry, the experience with the ANC off, you know, it kind of leaves them, um, you know, they're, they're, it's, it sounds pretty good, but it's also kind of flat. You know what I'm saying? You're going to lose a little bit of bass and I don't know, man. But as soon as you flip on that switch right there, that, that switch right there, that ANC switch. This joint has got me open. Ooh, that's my favorite song. It brings these headphones to life. You're going to get some really almost like ear piercing treble, man. <laughs> You're going to hear all the tweets. You're going to hear the like the symbols and, and the vocals really clear. I put my thing in motion. I do it all night long. You know, the mids kind of drop back a little bit and then you're going to get a little bit more bass as well. But these are not necessarily bass headphones. As a matter of fact, these headphones produce like a moderate amount of bass. So if you are a bass head, these might not necessarily be the ones for you. But if you like a, a clean music sound with a moderate amount of bass that focuses on, you know, vocals and instruments and stuff like that, these are going to be great for you. You're probably going to really like these because these really do showcase uh, the highs and, and, you know, a little bit of the mids of the music as well. Okay, so now we got to get into the call quality test of these headphones because they did kind of brag about the CBC noise canceling. So let me go ahead and uh, fire up my app and get this phone call test going. Yep, yeah, it's going right now. So right now you're hearing audio from... Uh, not this microphone, but the microphones that are in the headphones. So hopefully this sounds good. But you got to take it with a grain of salt because these apps right here, this thing right here, uh, it doesn't always do the best call quality test. I don't know. It's just something about all the apps I've played around with trying to record uh, call quality on earbuds and um, 
and headphones via Bluetooth. But yeah, just like I said, take it with a grain of salt, man. It's gonna sound a little bit better than what you're hearing right now. But in conclusion, I really do think these are great headphones. As a matter of fact, I'm impressed with the sound with the active noise canceling uh, on, and I'm impressed with the design. I, honestly, I think that's probably the most you know attractive thing about these headphones. It's like a conversation piece, man. This is just a work of art. Uh, oh, I said work of art. You get that? It's a work of art. <laughs> Okay, it slipped, but it worked. Okay, so yeah, this is, I mean, they are truly a work of art as far as design. I love it, love it, love it. And of course, they do sound good. Hopefully that call quality was good. I'll let you uh, make the decision on that right there. But yeah, man, if this was something you was checking out and having your Amazon cart, I say it's all right to go ahead and pick them up. But I ain't no expert on this kind of stuff. But what I do know is life is short. So you might as well be getting your jam on. I gotta hit them with a... I gotta go make some more videos so i gotta run man but while i'm going y'all keep that party going throw me some emoji hands up in the comment section and i'll see you when i see you oh so you one of them cats that like to just run up in place take what you want then leave huh man you better hit that subscribe and notification button that way you know when i'm over here opening up new stuff and while you're down there you might want to consider tapping that uh join button and becoming a member because membership has its perks See, that wasn't so bad. All right, man, I appreciate you, and I'll see you at the next one. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?